Conservative MPP Roman Baber has been kicked out of the Ford government caucus. The York Centre MPP called for an end to the lockdown this morning, and the Premier says he's spreading misinformation. Let's go to CTV's Colin DeMello with the developing news. Colin. Oh, well, when Nathan, over the last few months, Roman Baber had spent a considerable amount of time and effort trying to convince his own government that the lockdowns are harmful and unnecessary, trying to convince the government to end the lockdowns. Uh, he took that public today, issuing a very public letter to the premier. And as a result, Roman Baber has now been expelled from the progressive conservative government. As Premier Doug Ford fights a pandemic, today he found himself fighting a member of his own government. Premier, we've seen a great... MPP seen... Roman Baber issued a public letter this morning calling on the government to reverse the COVID-19 lockdowns in Ontario, claiming they're doing more harm than good. If the medicine is killing the patient, then perhaps we should reconsider the medicine. And I am of the view that, that lockdowns are much deadlier than COVID. The virus has taken 5,200 lives in Ontario, left 1,600 people in hospital and nearly 400 people in ICU. Public health doctors say without additional intervention, those numbers will continue to grow. The letter was met with immediate blowback from Premier Doug Ford, who has, in the past, complimented Baber at Queen's Park. I want to thank the great member from York, York Centre. He's doing a great job there. Today, in a statement, however, the Premier forcefully pushed back, saying Baber's comments are irresponsible. By spreading misinformation, he is undermining the tireless efforts of our frontline health care workers at this critical time. And he's putting people at risk. I will not jeopardize a single Ontarian's life by ignoring public health advice. Back to the member from York Center for Baber was then swiftly kicked out of the Progressive Conservative Caucus. Colin, I've been made to understand um, uh, shortly after 9 a.m. that I will no longer sit with the Conservative Caucus. But Baber does not find himself alone in the opposition benches. Former PC MPPs Belinda Carajalios and Randy Hillier have also expressed similar views on the pandemic. There's a lot of anger over this letter within the Ford government itself. In fact, Health Minister and Deputy Premier Christine Elliott issued a statement of her own today, calling on Baber to apologize to any family members of those who have lost loved ones and, of course, the frontline health care workers who have been tirelessly working during this pandemic. Reporting live, I'm Colin DeMello. Now back to you.